Hello and welcome to this week's Something for the Weekend from your friends here at Martin Lynch and Sons. In a few moments time, Gary's going to have a little demonstration with the FTDX 101 and the SCU LAN 10. Of course, you can also do that with the FTDX 10. Uh, and uh, then I'll be back and I'll show you a few of our special offers. Uh, if you've not already checked out our podcast, episode one is out now. Episode two will be out uh, very shortly if it isn't already up. Uh, so do make sure you either listen to that and you can find that on Spotify and iTunes and pretty much wherever you get your podcasts from. Uh, it's also available with video here on YouTube. So if you want to see what the inside of Gary and I's houses look like, you can do that as well. Also, don't forget to, 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 to subscribe to our YouTube channel. The subscribe button looks like this. And don't forget to click the bell notification. And a bell looks like this. And uh, that's one for the Henry in the edit. And uh, if you do that, you click to that little bell icon, it means you get a notification every time that we either upload a video or go live, because of course we do go live on a Saturday afternoon. Right, without further ado, let's go over to Gary. Okay, so well, thanks, Jonathan. Um, so what I'm gonna do is gonna show you the SCU LAN 10. Now this is a, a, a small box which you can connect to the um, 101 or the DX10 um, or the FTDX10 should I say um, and this enables you pretty much to work the radio from anywhere in the world it does need a little bit of setup um, I think Mark's actually going to do a little video in the future showing you how to do that um, but I'm going to show you the the, um, the setup when it's actually working and, and what it actually does. And while I'm over here, what I'll do is if I show you this, uh, also this Nissi SWR meter, this is the high power version of the, of the 103. Um, these are new in, Martin had these uh, he's done for, for us. Um, they're absolutely fantastic. It gives you up to 1,200 watts um, at the flick of a switch. Basically, you can go between the two ranges um, and it gives you a nice sort of display. Um, here you can actually see we're just 10 watts and SWR of 1 with zero reflected power. So that's all good. So um, let's uh, whiz over now to the other screen and uh, we'll, we'll look at these actually working. I've actually got one already set up. So what does it actually do? Well here I've got it actually running on my, on my laptop. Um, you can pretty much take that anywhere in the world. So um, what I can do here, I've now got the... 101 running on my on my laptop now providing that I've actually set this up with a with a D, um, with a, an external IP address and uh, opened up maybe a couple of ports just to get it to work um, I can take this anywhere in the world and um, providing I've got internet access and the radios on at home it's I can actually work the radio you can also share it with your friends all these details they can download the software you can give them all the login credentials and they can actually um, work the radio um, if that's not enough for you and you want a bigger screen you can put this on your desktop if you've got maybe a second home or a holiday home or something like that and you've got a desktop there and you want to work your main radio from anywhere you can put it on two we've got two big screens here here I've actually got uh, the, the software running here as well um, and you can see that it's running on two big TVs or one big TV you can do quite a lot with this um, I'm not going to go into great detail now, it's not the sort of video to do that, but it, it's a very, very good uh, piece of software and it's getting better all the time, so with each and every update. So anyway, that's pretty much a sum up. Um, thanks for watching, so it's back over to Jonathan. Thanks Gary, all very interesting, I might have a play with that later. Um, I'm going to go through a few bits and pieces now that I'm uh, in the text of the something we had email. If you're subscribed to the email, make sure you are. Uh, we'll start off with the uh, VGC VRN7500. I did get that the right way around. Uh, just to very quickly inside the box, everything you expect. There's a radio in right underneath that as well. It's, it's hiding. That's the, um, that's the nice one that um, uh, you can control from your smartphone, uh, either Android or iOS. Uh, they are in stock and available now. Do check the website for all the latest uh, offers. Uh, we have the Unidum uh, UBC uh, 125 XLT. Uh, lovely handheld little scanner. If you're uh, in the market for something relatively inexpensive, but that also performs very well, and also has Unidum's uh, close call feature on it as well, that's a, a very good option too. Uh, we also have uh, the Whistler TRX2, the desktop, or I suppose you could put one mobile as well, um, with, uh, with digital modes on it as well, including uh, DMR. Uh, 
next up we have the Yezu uh, FTM 300. Uh, it's, we did a video on this um, not too long ago, we included it in the Zomspot video as well. Uh, VHF, UHF, 50 watts out, Bluetooth on it as well, APRS, C4 FM. It packs quite a punch in such a small box. Uh, next up, uh, we've had these for, um, for quite a long time, we've been selling these for quite a while, and they're still as popular as ever, the CG3000 from CG Antenna, the external remote uh, ATU. I'm going to get this one out of the box because it, it's, uh, it's, just, it's just a black box to look at, but um, it, is, uh, it is worth looking at so you can see how it uh, works. Uh, it's uh, very similar to um, uh, HTC Maker Tudor, very similar to this. Uh, this is uh, say an external tuner, long wire on the top, uh, coax and power going on the bottom, and we do supply it uh, complete with the remote control unit as well. It comes as a package on that one. Uh, and finally, uh, back in stock uh, by popular demand, the uh, MP60 uh, power supply. So 60 amp switchman power supply. Uh, with our own brand, our Mydale brand on it. Uh, these are very popular. Uh, if you're trying to run your whole shack off one power supply, maybe you've got a few radios, a good one to go for. That's the MP60 back in stock available now. So check out everything um, on the Southern People Weekend email. If you're not subscribed to it, make sure you go to the website, scroll all the way down, there's a yellow banner, pop your email address in there and that will subscribe you and we'll email you every Friday. Lovely, that's it for now. Thanks very much for watching. As I say, don't forget the podcast. Don't forget to make sure you're subscribed and have got the notifications turned on in order to see when we go live on uh, the weekend. Uh, this weekend, you've got myself. So I'll see you tomorrow. Thanks very much. Bye-bye.